up everybody, it's Kinesis Crab. Oh shit, the skip feature turned on by accident. Okay, so, uh, what did we miss here? So that's that, let me introduce you to again. This is Super Sonico, she's a college student. Yes, I'm well, I just started school with Spring Sheet. Okay, then. Fresh, oh, like a fish? I, I fish usually seen as like, like dead fish usually seen as not fresh. She sure is a mysterious one. Did you try not to sound okay? Anyway, Sonic was doing some modeling on the side, and she's brand spanking new to the business. Even though she sounded like. She even though she sounded like she'd fucking done this shit before a sec ago. And I've known the president of Sonico's agency for a long time. I guess birds of a fucking weird feather stick together. He doesn't usually ask favors like this. But he really wants us to help Sonico get started as a Gravier model. I think that's how you say it. Oh hey, is it model or idol? Because now we're saying two different things. Because like an idol has different responsibilities than a model or a singer. They are a little bit of both and lots of other stuff. So that's what brings her here today. And I know this is a bit sudden, but you're free after this, right? I was just planning to sort the outtakes from my last shoot. My mentor's mouth curls up into an evil smile. Scary things happen when he smiles like that because anime. You can do that later. What about you, Sonico? Should we have to this? Oh shit, I forgot to give him the voice. Uh, yeah! I don't have any school or work today! How's your skin today? How's what kind of question skin? is that? Uh, like, look at her, you can tell. I slept really well last night, and I'm feeling super good today! One time I got sunburned in the stupidest pattern on my face and I don't even know how and it was the most awful like couple days of my life. Excellent, excellent. Alright Ryota, if you really think you're not cut out for this then I'll give you a test. A test? Quizushimas. This is all too sudden. Yes, right. Sonica will be the model, of course. She's completely silent. I feel like I can see a giant question mark over her head, and I bet I'm making a really stupid face right now. Sure you are. Our eyes meet. I turn away quickly, overcome with shyness, because I'm anime. Take some shots for Sonico's portfolio. You can choose your outfit for my private collection. You already know your way around the studio. I'm not going to give you a theme or anything, just take whatever pictures you think suit Sonico. Okay. Well, I'll be in my office. Give me a call when you're done. With that, he disappears into his office. Like, the thing I'm going for with that manager is, like, fucking, like, I don't even know. Just, it both, every character in this game is just going to be annoying voice in some way, because they're all severely anime. This sucks. Come on, man, pull yourself together. Bow my head to Sonic. You already did this shit. You already did self-introductions, this isn't important. I know it's sudden, but I've been meaning to have her promo shots redone. I'd appreciate a good set. Oh, a nice fellow after all, that's a relief. If you can't deliver, I hear the bottom of Tokyo Bay is nice this time. Ahem, I've said too much. <laughs> I take it back, he's freaking me out. The mask suits him perfectly. Whatever. Oh darn, I completely forgot. I'm sorry, but I need to speak with Mr. Otakin about a different matter. Go ahead and get ready, Sonico. I'll be right back. What? Huh? You still don't get to, like, actually play the game for a little bit. <laughs> I attempt to smile as well. I'll go get your outfit. You don't know her fucking, like, proportions. I'm sure that's gonna be something you ask in the dumbest way possible because anime. If you wanna laugh at me for being pathetic, go ahead. No, I'm laughing at you because you're a fucking stereotypical anime protagonist, and that's just stereotypical anime shit. Like, seriously. I've made my strategic retreat. It was not strategic. But now that I'm here, I really can't make up my mind. Should I go with something safe, or should I pick something challenging? That girl's got charm. 
She's really cute, and what a figure. Can't really express it well, but I feel like she's got potential. I haven't even had a proper conversation with her yet, but that's what I think. But what can I do to make her really shine? Hmm. Excellent question. A model's outfit is really important. The outfit she wears for a shoot like this could actually impact her position in life, you know? You're right, especially since these are promo shots, this is a big responsibility. When choosing your outfit, you have to consider not only what her clients want, but also what kind of model you want her to become. And you can't forget your own pride either. I don't understand what that line's supposed to mean, because there's no pride system in this game. In a way, she's put her life in your hands. That means the buck stops with you, so you've got to trust your instincts. Keep that in mind and choose responsibly. Yeah, you're right. I've got to believe in myself. You gotta believe. That's the spirit. Well, since there's no special instructions this time, you'll probably be fine as long as you get her position right. I don't know what that means. Make sure you pay attention. Oh, the positioning graph. Yeah, there's like... It's this. When you do shit, like, it changes and you get a different ending based on it, but, like, chances are you're gonna get one real specific ending unless you know how to get endings because you're gonna accidentally lock yourself into a path. Closing menus in this game is really weird, by the way, it's left- it's right-clicking to close menus, and you're never told that. Whatever, just want to make sure you listen to your model, too. Yeah, so, Sonico will be like, yeah, I'm really happy to wear this, or like, this outfit fucking sucks, like, she won't say words, but she'll like, she'll like, either jump around or like, shake her head, and that's how you know. He didn't ask her sizes, now he's gotta go ask, I don't need the tutorial. It's a little late to ask now, but who's been giving me all this advice? Fucking tutorial people, man. Nobody's there. Shiver. Anyway, I've got to get back. I won't think about it. Nope. Head back to the studio. Try not to look behind you. Whatever. Kitamura is not back yet. Damn, it's making me nervous talking to her face to face like this. Hard to hell with it. So, what should I call you? Then, don't do this, you can, but this isn't beneficial, this is the right answer. I feel like Nico fits her better, but whatever. Then, can I just call you Sonico? How many times are we gonna do the Yoroshiku shit? That heart means I did it good. So, Sonico. Do, 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 do. This is actually the right answer, believe it or not. Sorry about earlier, my bae, but dig this. Sonico rules everything around me. Scream. Get the money. Yenny, yenny coins, y'all. I want to kill myself after reading that. Why is the C in Sonico capitalized? It's like, I don't understand. Focus, scream. I guess. I guess that's what it is. See, the heart was really big that time, meaning that was the best answer. I fucking hate it, because it made me want to kill myself, because it was the stupidest thing I've ever read in my life. What the heck am I trying to achieve? For real. Do not look at the headphones. Do not look here. Uh, face. Otherwise, your only option will be to ask about the headphones, which makes her not like you. Is Sonico nervous too? Her expression is pretty stiff. Maybe she's nervous about the shoot. You seem kind of tense. Really? Yeah, are you not used to photo shoots? She's already told you this. No, I am. I promise, I'm in top condition today. Is she wearing a fucking blazer skirt? Because that's like a late game item if she is. Really? Well, that's good. What about your hair and makeup? Do you usually do them yourself? Oh, yeah. I guess I'm the type that doesn't really need those things. That's fucking fake. This, this is a fake game. Do you have your makeup on now? A little. I was told that one of my selling points is that I can do shoots with practically no makeup on. Wow. It's true, her skin does look really good. I don't see why we have to ask her about her skin. Selling she... point? Uh -huh. I don't... Um... Uh, my other selling 
starting points would be... Um... I don't... Huh? What are you looking at? Oh my god. Huh? It's nothing. I should have just not clicked anything, but it's really unintuitive to have a system where you, like, you get multiple options and sometimes the right answer is none. Do you have it with you? Yes. Okay, don't choose your outfit while you do that. I thought you did that earlier. Ah, um, uh, sorry. You still haven't asked for what you need. Huh? Um, your sizes. A little shorter than 160 centimeters, about 158. I don't... I don't fucking speak foreign numbers. I live in America. I don't know how many feet that is, like five or six, or like four. Somewhere between five and six is what I'm gonna guess. Because that would be average height. So then... Is this something I can ask, even if she's a model? No, if I don't ask, I can't do my job. It's for my job, that's all it is. Measurements, yeah, I knew it. I need to know for the outfits. Yeah, oh, for the outfits, right, of course. Right. I forgot. Um, okay. From the top, there are 90, 57, 87, uh, and my cup size is S. I don't know how to read when the numbers are like that. I know that's a common way of giving them, but I don't know how to read it. Like, I don't know what it means. Those are some... I mean, no, wait, it's all a misunderstanding. And then, as I make excuses to no one in particular, I realize the person I should be making excuses to is standing right behind Sonico. Kitamura has returned, though when I have no idea, and is giving me that painful stare again. Should have just asked Kitamura from the beginning. But I think it's sort of his fault for being gone until now. Yeah. Oh, I should have just asked Mr. Kitamura. Ha ha ha. Why, why, why repeat yourself like that game dialogue? I am so spineless. Oh no, it's perfectly fine. I should have been the one to tell you. So sorry for not realizing. I was about to start swinging and then you'd have ended up like that writer who joked, Ah, oh, I shouldn't air my dirty laundry. Sorry about that. Please go ahead with your work. What happened to the writer? What were you going to swing? Somehow I managed to maintain my composure. Better not prod the hornet's nest. Oh right, could I take one picture first? Help me choose your outfit. Sh sure. Sh sure. This won't be in the for portfolio. Okay. Yeah. I feel like a parent taking a picture of his kid. That's really weird contextually for you to say that. Well, I can. S okay, yeah. So weird contextually. But will she be okay when we're doing the real thing? Well, I just gotta do my best. Okay, I'll go choose you out for now. Meet you back here in a few minutes. Am I recording? I just realized I don't know if... Oh, fuck. I fucking... I am recording, but I accidentally turned on the skip feature. Again. Okay. I can't backlog now because I'm in this. Your mentor, Adakin, has made you Super Sonico's personal cameraman. Will you be able to bring Sonico's beauty to life? Okay, so basically what she said was some shit like, um, I don't fucking remember. It's like, I don't know, just stupid shit probably over and over again because that's how this works. But um, next time we'll get into the actual game part of this game, which would be, um, you know, Super Sonico Outfit Simulator.